Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So a day or so ago, I posted a video where we took a quick look at some of the new features and improvements that were released and um, rolled out with the new Windows 11 version 22 H2 feature update. And as I mentioned in the video, uh, it wasn't a comprehensive list of every new feature, but um, a brief look at some of the most notable changes. And I will leave a link in the description to that video if that would be of interest. Now, basically, just to follow on from that video, as many of you may know, or if you were unaware, that uh, starting next month in October 2022, uh, Microsoft is going to start rolling out the first wave of new features um, that didn't make the initial release of the Windows 11 version 22H2 feature update. And these new features will be rolled out using the um, moment or moments updates. Now, um, a lot of these new features I have posted on previously when they were still being tested uh, in the Windows 11 Insider program. But nonetheless, just to keep you up to speed as to these new features that will be rolling out next month that didn't make the initial release of the feature update. Now, just to use some screenshots because these haven't officially been released yet to version 22H2. And I think the most anticipated new feature for a lot of users, including myself, is the new tabs and tab support we are going to be getting in the File Explorer where Microsoft is adding tabs and the uh, tab support in the file explorer and over and above that um, they're going to be making improvements to the left hand navigation pane that's going to reorganize the folder view for a better viewing experience and the tabs and um, what's actually supposed to the tab support in the file explorer was um, initially going to roll out with the, um, the feature update and when it was made available to the general public but um, nonetheless microsoft um, is now rolling that out next month in October with the moment or moments updates. Now I just head into the next screenshot and this is the new photos app which I actually posted on just a couple of days ago but nonetheless um, just to keep you up to speed for the purposes of this video and just to do a quick recap um, the photos app will be introducing a new photos managing experience where um, you'll get simplified browsing, finding and managing your collection of photos. And it's also going to allow you to easily back up your photos um, with OneDrive. And as Microsoft says, um, going to help you to enjoy a powerful experience on your other Windows devices. And it's also going to offer the new memories experience, as we can see in the screenshot. And also, you'll be able to see your OneDrive storage quota in the bottom left-hand corner of the Photos app. So that's also the new Photos app coming next month. And then um, moving on to the next suggested actions and this is suggested actions on copy and um, you can copy phone numbers future dates and get suggested actions such as making a call with teams or skype or adding an event in the calendar app so suggested actions also coming next month in october and then the taskbar overflow and as we can see in the screenshot um, the taskbar will offer an entry point to an overflow menu that allows you to view all your overflowed apps in one space so when your taskbar gets full of apps and you'll get the overflow menu, which is a three-dotted menu. You click on that and you'll be able to access those uh, those excess apps in that taskbar overflow um, menu, as we can see in the screenshot. And then um, just moving away from um, the screenshots, um, the last kind of improvement we will be getting is to the Microsoft Store, where um, um, Microsoft says that next month in October, um, there'll be updates to the Microsoft Store with screenshots uh, in the search results you'll be able to restore apps with a single click and android apps will appear in these search results so those are a couple of new features and improvements that will be made available um, in and through the microsoft store next month in october and then although um, these updates will be rolling out next month the, re the release date for these uh, new features for these moment or moments updates next month hasn't actually yet been confirmed by Microsoft, although we we know it, they will be rolling out next month in October 2022. Be that with the Patch Tuesday cumulative updates, or maybe they will be a completely separate update, as mentioned, the moment or moment moments updates. But if anything changes and these updates do start rolling out, I will let you know and post accordingly. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.